Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So Spider-Gwen and Sabretooth Arena round one is over. I already had both of them, so I did not go for either one of them in this past arena. Just went for milestones and of course the 5,000 uh, five-star shards uh, from the five-star featured arena. All right, so we're gonna take a look in a moment and see what friends actually appear on the leaderboards. Who wanted a Spider-Gwen? I don't know. All right, let's go ahead and jump on over there. And as you can see, I have not started the uh, Sunday arena. I'm probably going to run it at least a little bit, but I was thinking about skipping it and doing uh, Act 7. So we'll see. I might end up doing both today. Uh, kind of been a lazy day. All right, let's go ahead and uh, go to the completed. And... Da -da 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 -da. Okay, yep. So we got the 5,000 five-star shards. So let's go back over here. Start from left to right. Sabretooth, basic arena. Uh, number two, Black Devil. Congratulations already. Okay. I think a lot of folks that um, are scoring that high, they already have the champion, but they are going for battle chips. As much as a lot of you, you know, think that I grind arena like a crazy person, I'm certainly not the craziest arena grinder. Black Gamer, congratulations, man. For example, for these, I just did milestones. But there are people who, even if they're not going for the champion, still put up high scores because they want to get those battle chips and, you know. But I like to take it easy from time to time. So even though I do go harder than most of you guys, uh, I'm definitely not up there with the top arena grinders. All right. And I really don't know anyone that told me they are actually going for this guy so unless it's just for battle chips uh saber tooth four star uh i think some may have gotten him by accident i was trying to be very very careful and you can see i tried to stop right after i got the milestones but sometimes i'm a, a completionist so sometimes i gotta finish and that will be just enough to get me the champion if he went really low. But it's all good if we get the champion or if we didn't. Doesn't really matter. Um, not the four star. But I don't want to get the champion if I can help it. All right. Getting down here. We get to see the top 200. And because this is percentage based, a lot of folks that you are not seeing on these leaderboards um, also got the champion. But we get to see the top 200. So usually those that you see here, they um, really were grinding for the champion. Ah, the Meister. Uh, I, I watched uh, this cartoon, uh, Batman, I think. Uh, oh, which Batman was it? Uh, the, the Brave and the Bold, I think it was called. Uh, and definitely a, a fun one. one. One of the more fun. And in one episode, uh, there was this guy called the Music Meister. And I love that episode. The music was awesome in it. You don't usually hear that in a Batman, you know, cartoon. And I let my sister hear it and... She was like, she recognized him, uh, Neil Patrick Harris. And uh, he's always Doogie Howser to me. Uh, I didn't know he could sing, but he did a lot of Broadway. And my sister watches a lot of the Broadway stuff. So she recognized him. I was like, wow. But yeah, he was the voice of uh, the character. It was like the music meister plays the song that the world loves to hear. I mean, it was it was awesome. Uh, the music was definitely on there. Black Gamer, number 22? All right. Uh, so 
this is Spider Gwen, uh, featured four star. Now, a lot of people back in the day did not want to pull her. Uh, Black Devil, congratulations. Uh, they did not want to pull her. She was a meme champion. Uh, but recently, well, not that recent, but she got a rework. Now, I wanted her even before her rework, just because I, I just liked her. Now, uh, for you guys that are, are relatively new, you may not remember this, but she had a special one that didn't do anything. It didn't even make contact. It was a joke. Everybody used to joke about it. Um, she was on a node, unblockable special one, and uh, I guess more likely to, to fire the special one. The special one wasn't going to hit you. It was ridiculous, you know, and we were like, man, if you rework her, just make her special one do a little damage, you know, but they reworked her and now she's actually pretty good. Uh, I did not get her until long after her rework as a five star. I was kind of salty about that because out of everybody, you know, most people were talking about her meme champion if they pulled her in the crystal they were moaning and crying and here i was wanting her and that was before her rework and then later after her rework all these people that already have her now are like oh okay well you know that wasn't so bad you know and i'm like and i can't pull her really but we got her we got her eventually all right and just like in the other one, uh, we will see the top 200. But unlike the other arena, this one, the top 800 get the champion. So we'll see the top 200, but there will be 600 people that we don't see who also got the champion. But these are the folks who really wanted it and had the time to put in to uh, put up the scores to get on this leaderboard. All right. And hey, Prof Hoff, congratulations. I'm not sure if that's the real Prof Hoff or not. I think it is, but congratulations. All right. Yeah, if you did not have a Spider Gwen as a five star uh, or a four star, I would say grab this nice low pickup. I don't know what she went for, but I don't think she went very high. Now, you can see the score I put up. So what I'm finding right now is that going through all of my five stars once and then going through all of my six stars from that point on is giving me a score like this. And that just means that I could stop my five star grind a little bit earlier if all I want to do is put up, you know, 22 million. But. 23 is, is fine. It's not that uh, difficult for me to put that up. You know, one run, five stars, and then six stars whenever they come off cooldown, and that's it. All right, Black Devil, number 10. Woo, got in the top 10. Congratulations, man. Debo. Uh, Debo. So if you guys uh, don't know, if you ever watched uh, Friday and you remember the character Debo, uh, well, the uh, guy who, uh, what was his name, uh, Lester? Uh, I'm bad with names, so that might not be his name. Uh, but he passed away. So, you know, when I when I heard that, I was just like, oh, no, 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 no. So many folks uh, that have brought us a lot of joy, you know. They are just going. All right see anybody else now anyone that don't that doesn't have her i would expect them to go for her if they could just to you know pick her up maybe they got lucky before the rework and unlucky after the rework not to uh pull her so far so you know i say go for it man black gamer congratulations man big sexy what it do Picked up that Spider-Gwen. Okay. 
All right, let's see who else, who else we got here, man. And as always, uh, leave a comment and let us know what score you put up. It's very useful round one so that folks can have an idea of what uh, she went for and they can decide whether they want to try to, you know, allocate some time to pick her up. Now for me, I already have her now and she's awakened. So there's no need for me to go for her. Um, I'll be doing just what I did in this arena, you know, milestones. I usually don't do all of the milestones in the two-star arena. I just stop easy to get the 30,000 quick units. And then I just take a break. But um, next arena, we'll be doing the same. And I'm not sure who's coming out in the arena this uh, this Thursday. Um, but it might be someone new that I might want to pick up. I might start just going for new champions. You know, I, I messed up and did not go for Cosmic Ghost Rider. I went for Red Goblin instead. And while he's not a bad um, champion, he's not on the level of uh, Cosmic Ghost Rider. If I had to do it over again, uh, I would definitely go for Cosmic Ghost Rider and not Red Goblin. But it is what it is. Uh, we'll see. I'll try to pay more attention to uh, the whispers on the wind, I guess, uh, and see you know, whether the champion is good or not, because I saw and I was like, yeah, he looks pretty good. But at the time, you know, Red Goblin uh, seemed to be a little bit better. But, you know, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Uh, but anyway, that is going to do it for this video. We got a chance to look at uh, the arenas. I skipped the three-star arena because you can get the three star by just getting all the milestones in any of the featured uh, arenas. Uh, so I will get the uh, three star, I think, three times over. Four star featured, five star featured, and the three star featured. I get the milestones, top milestones and all of those. So I get the three star champion. So that arena is no longer uh, worth really looking at, to be honest with you. All right. But that's going to do it guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button. If you enjoyed it, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video and you all have a blessed day.